Welcome everyone to the new academic year. I am Dean Joan Bullock, and A3 is what I'm all about. And I want to remind you, if you have not already been told, that your time here as a law student, you are a legal professional because you've matriculated into law school. The standards as it relates to professionals in the legal profession apply to you. And I want to cover this A3 with you because it goes into helping you to manage your own life. There are three A's. The first A is about aptitude. Aptitude can be defined as your level of competence, your competence to do what you have set out to do, your suitability for the legal profession. But also, more importantly, from this point on, it's about your potential. Aptitude is not something that's static, you just have it and it's there and that's it. No, you have an aptitude for the study of law and to become a lawyer, a good lawyer, an outstanding lawyer. The next thing is your attitude. You have to have the right attitude to succeed. That means you need to believe in yourself. It's your mindset, it's your emotions, your beliefs, your behavior. You're already here. You don't have to prove yourself to your seatmates. You don't have to prove yourself to the professors. You don't have to prove yourself to me as a dean about your suitability to be here. The only person you have to prove yourself to is yourself. When you're struggling, and believe me, there are going to be days when you'll, you'll struggle and you'll wonder why you're here and you'll wonder if you have what it takes to remain. I'm gonna tell you, for each one of you, you'll have one of those days, at least one. And when you are looking for someone to give you that, those words of support, you may not find those words of support coming to you. The words of support are right now coming out of my mouth, and every time you see this A3, you should know that you have the aptitude, and it's all about your attitude as to whether you are going to stay here and do well, your emotions, your belief, and your behavior. Don't wait for somebody else to tell you you're doing a good job. Just do the good job. The next thing is all in. When I interviewed for the position of dean, I talked to the faculty and staff, and I indicated to them that it is important that they be all in. I need them, just like I need you, to be a partner with me in the vision for this law school. This law school is not about me, the dean. It's not about the faculty. It's not about the staff. It's about you, the student. So the last thing is the explore. You have to take risk, but not just any type of risk. They have to be calculated risk. You have to have initiative. Don't wait for someone else to tell you to do something if you know that is what you need to do in order to succeed. You have to be in control of your own destiny. So what does it mean to work hard? OK, you're 1L. This is fall semester. You have five courses three credits each, that's 15 hours of in-class time, and you better make every class. Then outside of class, three times that. You have 15 in-class hours, you have 45 outside class hours to study, that's 60 academic hours per week that you are devoting to this effort. So A3 is our little code, it's our little secret, because it is very personal to each one of you, so you each have it, but you all are applying it in your own special way. So keep the faith, remember A3, and I look forward to speaking to each one of you individually at some point in your law school career. And thank you for allowing me this time to speak with you.